Hello guys, okay, it's me the piano and um, as you can see um, I'm going to show you something special today and um, for today I'm going to show you how to play high life groups um, uh, let's say two composite guitar skills you must know you can run in between the groove any groove at all you want to but for today we are going to be using high life grooves you understand you can hear the groove already in the background now if you're not subscribed click on that subscription button click on that subscribe button let's go Okay, okay, okay. So I'm going to show you that skill what I just played. Now it's in between a highlight groove. I played something like this. So this way it ended. Now this is very very important. I think I'm just gonna drop it here. Now, um, if you have not subscribed to my channel, subscribe because this skill is very important. You know, a lot of piano players will be angry with me for showing you this skill. Now, you can use this skill on any groove at all, whether you're playing high life, whether you're playing jazz, whether you're playing hip hop, reggae, you can use it. It's a very good skill. So, I'm going to give you slowly by slowly um, I'll drop the tempo I'll drop the tempo of the song of the beat okay so that you can get it we use this tempo then later later I can increase speed so this is like the I play something like this okay let me go again the key of F you can apply this on any key now this is what I did the first one first one so let me take it beat by beat so six five six five three so you get five six five three. Then I have two three five two three five three two one. So you get five six five five six five three two. Let me go again. Okay. Five six five three. Get it? Five six five three. Then two three five three two one. Five six five three two three five three two one. Very easy. Okay, let's play the beat. To show more of this on my master class, don't forget my master class is coming up on the 13th of uh, next month. Um, that it's displayed here, you can see it right on the screen, you can see it here on the screen. So, 
um for those of you who are interested i've dropped a link below this video you can click on that link and learn more about it and pick your tickets okay so like i said applying the first round release only so good then the second one grab So the second one, the second one now is. Eight nine eight seven six five. So have so good. So let's play with the beats. So I just have to. I just like this. version of this skill so I'm um, playing it slow just like you join me back but I just have to do that for you so, so. so that's the first one go to the third movement so I've got it so the next one is this What do you do? So, so as you're doing, so we do. Uh, so you have your five, five, six, seven, six, five, three, five, six, seven, six, five, three. So So 5,6,7,6,5,3 So let's run it You just apply it on other places. So you do something. This way it ends. But just for clarity's sake, I'm still going to give you it because some people like if I say same thing, apply it on the other, they will be like, ah, what well, that same thing did you? I'm going to give so what's up that what's up that the second one is Show you the first one, show you the second one, show you the third one, show you the fourth one, then I'm in the fifth one. So this one is two, two, three, five, 
three two one two three five two two three five three two one so go guys and then and the next one is first one is second one is So that's it, that's it. That's it about the chord. You can now play a beat man. So I'm playing the beat. This loop for rehearsal is there. You can inbox me, drop my contact there. So I'm about um, 3000 euro. You can order this loop now. From there, you cannot even look speed. Let's say you want to increase. Okay, you can we use it? You cannot break them. You know, you can actually become creative about it. You can break them sequence by sequence, one by one. You can do something like this instead of just running. And this something like you can do you can do something like this you can just break this chord this scale into different ways you can do you can just break them you can do something like So, so, uh, but just know that the scale I want you to know it is. Now, let's try increasing the speed for it and let's see what we got. I think we can manage the speed. So, you go. With this video, you can go start like So let's say we want to arrange the solo
guys, if you have low speed for that, if you keep reacting, you develop more speed. Apart from playing just like uh, a lead guitar, you can actually you can actually play other sounds with it, and it's going to still sound fine. For example, for example, let me look for a sound. Okay. Now, now this is a total different sound apart from a lead guitar. Now let's drop it down a little. Let's draw the tempo down a little. Now watch this. Watch. Okay, let me give it the rusty sound. Um, one minute.
that's it that's it about it so thanks for watching and um stay tuned for the next video it's going to be nice now don't forget don't forget to subscribe to my channel and click on the notification button so you can get notified when new videos thank you very very much bye Thank <music> you.